Candidate of PDP in the upcoming uh, Anambra Commission election 2021, which is going to be on November 6, a day of destiny. I've done a lot of uh, videos, reached out to a lot of people, especially locally. This is a message I'm passing on to our people outside of Anambra Streets, our diasporans. As in Kambeke, no, 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 the reason I'm in this race is for uh, betterment, for the good of India Nambra. I'm here because, like you all, I'm uncomfortable with the status quo. There's a lot we can do to change our story. There's a lot we can do, especially leveraging on the exposure, the contact, the network, the wherewithal that you guys have. There's a lot we can do collectively to change our story. Thank God also have in mind, not just as a candidate, but maybe top contender in this race. Imagine through a process considered the most transparent and free. Through a party that's considered the better of all options. Through messaging, content that we consider superior to what others have. And therefore, Oman Nem, I'm here to share with you a little snip. We've shared our manifesto already uh, online. But let me talk a little bit about it. I've also held a number of Zoom meetings across our diasporas in the US, in South Africa, in the UK, and other parts of Europe, and also those who are living outside of Anambra within Nigeria, where I presented this manifesto, where we intend to leverage various approaches to change our story. One approach is clustering approach. We want to actually focus on key clusters that when we get things right there, make things functional, create the infrastructure, create the enabling environment, make sure we get things proper there. I can tell you Anambra got Chawapo, which is the mantra we go by. Onisha cluster can help our label if we fix Onisha well, create a new, a better port system, create a better environment where business can thrive, where logistics can improve, where law and order discipline can come back to like where human beings live. We also can look at the gas and energy infrastructure. 